Okay guys, so real quick, I wanna let you know exactly what I did to get rid of my keloid bump after I got my nose pierced. Um, it wasn't fun <laughs> looking at that on my face, so I had to hurry up and go to YouTube and figure out how to get it off. And I came across this girl, uh, Maddie Perry. She had a regimen and I kind of followed hers. I didn't do it exactly um, step by step the way she did, but I'm gonna let you know exactly what I did for mine. First of all, I prayed. <laughs> Because I just pray about everything. That's my lifestyle. And I was like, God, get this bump off my nose. <laughs> no, but for real, I prayed on it. And then after that, I went and I got some of this Morden salt. And I got some of this tea tree oil. I forgot exactly where I got the oil from. But I think you can get it from like any store. And I know you can get salt from any store. And then get like a pack of clean Q-tips. Make it into like a paste. So add like a couple tablespoons or whatever, put it in a bowl or a cup, anything that you can have covered. Like you can cover it with aluminum foil or you can get like a little container. I know they sell those um, like travel containers for like soap in the store. Like when you have to like get on a plane and you don't want to like buy a whole bunch of new stuff. They just have like cute little um, small, you know, things that you could buy to put stuff in like your toothpaste or like soap and stuff like that so I really bought one of those I forgot what I did with it but um yeah I put the salt and the tea tree oil together <clears throat> mix, mixed it like a paste and then put it on my nose with the q-tip at night and then um after I got done with that I would put a band-aid on top of it and I would go to sleep and then in the morning wake up and wash your face and just get a clean q-tip and put some water on over the area make sure all the salt and the oil is gone and I don't have my neosporin right now I don't know what I did with it at the moment but I actually did get some neosporin like the one that you put on like cuts and scrapes it's like a um, some type of little medicine I know most people know what neosporin is but I would put that on my nose and then just go throughout the day with that on there and then when I got back home repeat the step again every single night so um, basically just do that for like every single day for a week and a half two weeks I saw uh, results in like a few days honestly and the bump just got smaller and um, you know it kind of is like a pimple so stuff is going to ooze out of it and I know it's going to be nasty why am I still holding this <laughs> but um, anyways yeah just put the the paste that you made with the salt and the oil on there at night put a band-aid over it take it off in the morning wash your face put some neosporin in it go throughout the day and repeat it again and um, you should see results pretty fast like just keep the area clean and put this on there and just be patient and hopefully yours will go away just like mine did and um, yeah I hope this video helps somebody I know that those uh, bumps are not cute so just stay with it I promise it'll get off your face there is hope <laughs> all right bye guys thanks for watching